Hi, this is Pat and Sue and Heston, which is our Red Prado, and Tweak, which is our Moby Nomad. I'm just going over the boxes that we have attached to the back of the Nomad. We removed the jerry cans that were in the holders at the back, um, and we ordered some boxes from MW Toolbox in O'Connor. Um, both boxes cost us about $650 to get made. They've got seals and locks. Um, it's good with the covers over the locks so the dust doesn't get in. Um, we had them made 300 deep by 340 wide by 740 high. We did remove the bracket that was holding on the jerry cans. Um, we've still got that installed so you just take out a bolt um, and remove the bracket and we left the side brackets on. We then bought some rubber matting from Bunnings, um, a koi matting to put between the metal pieces. So that's the koi matting, so you can see it's rubber. It can breathe, it can um, take the jarring, um, so metal isn't rubbing metal um, when we put the box in. Also, if the water gets in, um, the box does sit up on the top of the matting and the water runs through the mesh part of the koi. So, mm -hmm. As you can see underneath the box, we extended a metal uh, shelf underneath, pop riveted it underneath. We then glued on that rubber matting. On the side portions, we glued on the matting, drilled holes through and then bolted the actual box onto there. What you do need to keep in mind, of course, is the jerry cans were about 20 kilos 20 litres of fuel plus the weight of the metal jerry cans. The boxes each weigh 8 kilos. We've kept it um, light because what we are doing is actually hanging it out from the van so you do have to keep in mind the weight that you're now putting onto that bottom shelf. Um, so the lighter stuff you store in it the better. So lift out the flap so again, this box is from MW Toolboxes in O'Connor. So all we've got in there is our ramps and boards to go underneath the legs if we need to in sand. And we've got um, flippers, so nice and light. So that whole box would probably still only weigh about 9 to 10 kilos max. Um, so if you are putting these boxes on the back of your Moby Nomad in place of the jerry cans, please remember to keep the weight down because you are hanging out of the back. Plus use those rubber matters, mats from Bunnings um, to take the shock absorbing um, when you're going over rough terrain. Um, in this box on the right, we've just got a blower vac. We've got our reef shoes and our gum boots. So again, nice and light in there. We did put a shelf in this one. Um, comes with a rubber mat, uh, rubber buffer around the whole thing so it is sealed nicely um, the locks are very good and like I said you can actually then close the flap over it so no dirt gets in the lock we added the reflectors on it for the back um, so we got both boxes removed the jerry cans that were initially there uh, increased the uh, shelf underneath took off the bracket that fitted around the jerry cans and then bolted the boxes into place.